hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel, you guys. And welcome back to Wraps and Scraps channel. So, I am back really, really quickly to share this, as you can see in the title of the video. I want to share this with you. I hope you guys are all having a great day, a great week. Today is my last day in my 30s. Tomorrow is my birthday. Yes, I am turning 40 years young tomorrow, okay? 40 years young. So today is my last day in my 30s. And it's also, um, today has been a real big day of reflection for me. I've just really spent a lot of time just thinking about the different things I did in my 30s and all that jazz. So so what are we talking about today? As you can see in the title, you already know what we're talking about. So let's get into it. So today, um, there's two things that I'm going to be talking about. As you guys already know, those of you that seen the other video, we talked about the coach, um, Shat, Sat, the Katie Satchel bag last time um, I did my video. This was the bag that I bought in case you have not seen. This is the bag. But you know, I don't just stop there. I gotta do a little bit, a little bit extra. So, what did I do? Well, she's gotta go get the shoes to match. Why? Because she's a little bit extra, as my daughter would say. So, yes, you guys, I went. Now, let me tell you about this shoe. First of all, it's a very comfortable shoe. It is very well made, nice and plushy in there. It's got the cute little coach emblem here on the back. As you can see, it's a size nine and a half. Um, really beautiful leather. It is not the exact same color as the purse. Now, as you can see, there is a bit of a difference, but when it's on your foot, you can't see that. I think they just have the colors reversed pretty much. Um, it's a little bit off, but not really. Uh, but I love it. Okay. So why I chose to get this shoe? Well, as you can see from my skin color, this is my nude. This is a nude for me. I'll show you the shoe with me. Um, trying it on, but this is my nude. And I think this shoe goes really well with, with jeans as well as tights, because you guys who know me know I love tights and skirts and dresses and all of that jazz. So I will be wearing this with all of that above, everything. Okay, I might put on the long sundress I'm wearing, it just depends, because it just matches the purse so well, you know, because it just matches the purse so well, okay? So a um, little backstory about these shoes. I had a really hard time finding them. I did check the Coach Outlet store first. You guys know I always say check the Coach Outlet store first. So I did check there, but they were out of them. Look at the stitching in there. I want you guys to see the detail here. Just really well made. You could see the little plushiness right there just from looking, I'm sure. Excuse my nails, you guys. I got an appointment tomorrow to go and get that done. But um, really nice. I even like the little bead here. That's fine. The little string of beads that's that's fine so one of the things i really love about this heel is the wood back i'm always looking to see if the back is wood now i'm not sure if that's real wood i'm assuming that it might be compressed real wood um because that's important because you don't have a heel this breaks so really wanted to make sure that was on there really well the backing is nice great design simple but everyone needs a simple a little simple pump Okay, so this is the one that I chose to go with. Now, I purchased this from Macy's, okay? I went in, they did not have my size. I'm normally a size nine, but they did not have a size nine. So here's what happened, just real, real quick. I went to the coach store in the mall to see if they had these shoes, okay? After I checked the outlet store, they did not. So I went to Macy's and they didn't have it in my size. So I went to the coach store. They did not have it in my size either. They actually didn't have any. They only had it in like the tan nude. And I keep telling people who have fair skin, people who are um, Caucasian or Asian or any other color that's lighter than the brown paper bag, let's just say that. Your nude is not our nude. Nude is supposed to be the color closest to your skin. This is more of a nude for me, even though it has pattern, this is more of a nude for me. If I put on tan shoes, you guys, that's not my nude, okay? So the lady at the front said, you know, oh, well, this is a nude, this will go, it's a nude. I said, this is your nude, this is not my nude, okay? We need more brown nudes, just saying. So they did not have it in this pattern in my size. So what I did is I tried on the nine, thank God I did that, just in the nude. I tried on the nine, that was too tight. So I tried on the nine and a half and that one fit perfectly. So I'm glad I actually went in the coach store because it allowed me to be able to try the shoe on to see which one I wanted to order from Macy's. OK, 
Okay, now I already told them this when I walked in. It's like, hey, I'm gonna be picking this shoe up at Macy's for two reasons. One, at Macy's it was 130 to 40 dollars for these shoes. At the coach store, which was literally right around the walking corner, like walk around the corner, it was right around the corner at the mall, and they wanted 190 something dollars for theirs. Okay, so assist is fitting to save her 60 bucks if she can. And and Macy's had free shipping to your home, and coach did not. So I went with Macy's. So I tried the shoe on and told them why I was doing it. And then I went back to Macy's and placed my order. Now Macy's told me it was gonna take two weeks to get my shoe. It did not. It took four days. Yep, four days and I, I had my shoe. So those are the shoes, the coach um coach um canvas. I forgot the name. I'll put I'll post it um on there. It's a nine and a half US and a 40 in Europe European, I'm assuming. So that's where I got these beautiful coat shoes from good old Macy's. So you guys, if you're checking for shoes and or purses or whatever that are coach related and you can't find them at the coat store, try Macy's. Okay, so that is what I bought next, okay? And I was just head over heels with just those two things. I was very, very happy with myself. Um, but then my daughter, because she's amazing, decided to order me the wallet. Yeah, she ordered me the wallet because it was Mother's Day and she said that I could have it. And so I said, okay. So I went and picked up the wallet. Now the wallet is in the exact same print as the purse, okay? So we got the wallet. Here is the wallet. I chose to go with a small one. So it only has just a little here and there. Um, it has three slots for your cards right here, one, two, three. And then it has a wallet section here for cash. And then the back of it has a zippy right here, which I keep more medical cards, okay? So that is the wallet. Wonderful little um, zippy pouch here. The coach stamp right here, okay? And then on the front, it has so this is the wallet. So I have the wallet and this snap on here is no joke. Okay, coach don't play when it come around to their snaps. Look, listen, you hear that? Look, when I open it, look. I know it's probably minute to some, but look. You see that? That's a snap. <laughs> That's a nice snap. All right, so I've got the coach wallet. I'll put all the information of the name of it and all that stuff in the description box. This was, I think, 50 something dollars. The shoes were 140. The purse, in case you missed the other video, was 180. I got that from Amazon. Again, I tried to go on the coach outlet or just the coach store to look for this and I could not find it. So that is why I went with Amazon and Macy's, okay? So that's what we got. We got all three. Let's hold them up so you can see them all together. We got all three items here, the purse. I do have um, a coach case, a uh, glass case that I had from many years ago from one of my other uh, purchases that I'll probably add to this. And I'm actually, I took the inside out because it's like a bulky case. I don't know why back then they made the cases really bulky. So I'm probably going to keep my makeup in that one. Okay, so that is that. Um, you guys, it's my last day in my 30s and I'm just taking some time to reflect and think about how good God has been and think about the trials, the tribulations, the hard times, the good times, the lonely times, the wonderful times, the things of excitement like when we purchased our home, uh, the times where I thought I wasn't going to make it to the next day. It's just been an emotional day for me. Um, just kind of thinking back on all that has transpired and overall I'm very grateful to be here. I'm grateful that God allowed me to even be able to see 40 soon. And I hope the next 10 years <clears throat> exceed the 10 years that just passed. Uh, that's my hope and I pray that I'm here to see it. But uh, last week I had a day surgery. Yeah, day surgery. So I'm not in my best condition right now for my 40s. So I can't go out and like party and do all the stuff that I really wanna do. I really wanna be on somebody's beach with a margarita. I'm not going to lie. That's what I really want to do. But in the situation that's going on, I got staples and all kind of stuff going on. So I can't do that right now. <laughs> but 
after this is all said and done, I assure you, I will find somebody's beach and sip somebody's pineapple martini of some sort and be very happy, okay, if God willing. So, I'm not dressed today, okay? This is, I'm just around the house and this is what I chose to put on because it's comfortable, it's loose. I told you guys I just had a surgery, so I'm trying to keep it loose, okay? So that is that. I know my little skirt is kind of short, sorry y'all. I'm gonna make sure I cover all my parts, don't worry. So, that is the shoes with the purse. That is what's going on in my life right now, you guys. It's my birthday tomorrow. I will be doing another video tomorrow because I already got my birthday gift and it's upstairs and I wanna show you guys so bad, but I'm trying to wait and do it tomorrow. <sighs> but it's eating at me because I'm impatient. But yeah, I'll do it tomorrow. But you guys, I got another purse video coming. I got another presses that I got that my honey ordered for me and I'm so excited and I will share that with you guys tomorrow, okay? So, so remember to stay wrapped in scraps, meaning repurpose, recycle, reuse all parts of your life. I know I have not been doing, I just, I just have, let me apologize. Let me first apologize because I haven't done any videos on DIYs, crafts, home decor, none of that. And it's because I have been busy with trying to get surgeries and all kinds of stuff like that. I mean, things that I need, not not cosmetic surgery, but other stuff that was needed. And I'm trying to do, I'm trying to deal with it and still work through and still bring you guys some content. So um, that's what's going on with me. But remember to repurpose, recycle, reuse all parts of your life, okay? Turn the good into something bad. That's what I'm gonna try to do in my 40s is the things that I did not like that transpired in my 30s. I'm gonna try to flip it and bring some good out of it in my 40s. That's my goal. Okay, and I want to thank you all for joining me. Stay wrapped in scraps. Stay loving you. Can't love anyone else if you don't love you. Stay loving God. Stay loving life. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.